Hey guys, it's Paige, and I'm back with another vlog. So we're in Punta Cana at a resort. I'm here with my sister. I'm gonna uh, turn the camera around and show you guys the view. This is um, where we were staying. I got my breakfast, and we don't know what we're gonna do for the day, so we gotta figure it out. We got here last night. Or yesterday evening, I should say. We didn't really do much. We just chilled because we were tired from traveling. Um, so we're going to eat breakfast and then we're gonna figure out our uh, plan. All right, we're eating lunch now. I have a burger and some fries. We booked like an excursion to Santo Domingo tomorrow. And today we're just gonna chill at the resort. We have reservations tonight, but otherwise we're just chilling by the pool, not doing too much. This is the lobby of the resort we're staying at. It's really cute. here I'll show you guys like a better picture of the view and this is a better view of the ocean it's just so nice you can't see it all but I'll show you guys later on a better view this is more of the resort it's really pretty um, we're on our way to our room to just like chill for a little bit and then we're gonna go back to the beach I'm gonna show you guys where our room is all right I booked at the last minute so they didn't have like any oceanfront rooms available in this resort it doesn't seem like they have a ton of oceanfront um, rooms anyway because um, I don't know, the restaurants, like the a la carte restaurants and all that kind of stuff are more so the oceanfront stuff. But anyway, we have like a golf um, course view. So it has this little lake thing. And our room is in this building over here. Isn't that so pretty? This is our room. This is like the same um, hotel chain that I stayed at, Barcelo, um, when I was in Mexico. And I like the rooms here, but I like the room in Mexico better. The rooms that they had, they were just a little bit more modernized, but the rooms are nice. So this is our view. We just have a view of the golf course. And it's also quieter over here, so I like that as well. Okay, so this is the bathroom. This is the shower area. And this is the bathroom or the toilet area. I'm trying to like give you guys like a better view of the shower, but it's the best. View I can give you and of course this is the sink um, yeah I got this bathing suit from Shein and the cover-up so that's what I've been wearing today All right, we are going to dinner this is what I'm wearing to dinner I just have my Gucci sandals and I got this outfit on sale at I Express I have like three different versions of these little linen outfits I think they're really cute and and I'm also wearing my St. Laurent Uptown pouch. And well, and this is my face. Just put on some light makeup because we are running late and I don't wanna miss our reservation. Um, I was gonna put on lashes, but I don't have time for that, so. I'm sweating because we basically ran here because we were like, late for our reservation we had like a 15 minute grace period and we made it by like two minutes so we're at a steak is 
it steak or Spanish? We're at a Spanish restaurant. All right, I was wrong. It is a steakhouse that we're at right now. This is dinner. It's salmon and a baked potato and corn and broccoli. Friday morning um, we're on our way to Santo Domingo I forgot my camera um, which I'm really well not really mad but I'm disappointed about because I wanted to take pictures with my camera but I forgot it which probably is a good thing because I think it's supposed to rain anyway now I don't have an umbrella or anything um, but yeah, so I will include a few clips from um, Santo Domingo. Um, we're just gonna go hang out and get something to eat now. This is what I'm wearing. I got this uh, top on sale at Zara. Shorts are from Express and then I have my uh, Tory Burch um, sandals. We're on our way to go get something to eat. Um, Santo Domingo is fine. Um, but I was definitely ready to get back to the resort um i guess the only downside was that it took like so long to get there so that was like basically we can go, couldn't go to the um beach or the pool today so that kind of sucked but we have four more days really five more days but like four more days where we can just hang out at the resort so that's what we're gonna do um, we don't have reservations to like one of the little restaurants today so we're just gonna eat at the buffet and then just hang out afterwards we're eating now I'm not gonna lie the food here is not the best or my favorite it's just okay so far the buffet is just okay um, and the restaurant we ate at last night was also just okay it wasn't bad but I don't know I'm not satisfied with the food but we'll see how everything else goes back to the room because she's tired because we've been gone all day so I'm just sitting here relaxing um there's like a show tonight but I don't know if I want to watch that they I think tonight they have like an imitation Michael Jackson type of thing um that I don't really want to watch so I don't know if I'm gonna do that or not, but I think for the rest of the night, I'm just gonna chill. City's supposed to come out later, so we're just gonna chill, and I will see you guys tomorrow. All right, this is my breakfast. I got papaya, pineapple, star fruit, and an omelet. All right, we're finally on our way to the beach. I don't know if I showed you guys, like, I don't know what I showed you guys previously, but in case I didn't show you guys the resort or the pool area, there it is. Sydney went out earlier and got us a um, lounge chair because we learned the hard way yesterday that we need to come out earlier and like save a spot. Okay. 
otherwise we just won't have like a good place to sit or really any place to sit. And down here is where the uh, beach is. I forgot to tell you guys that my cover up in my bathing suit is from Shein. Um, I'm also going to use this, which I love. I got it from uh, ColourPop a while ago. Um, it's their glow oil. I'm going to put it on and show you guys what it looks like. But I love wearing this like in the summertime, um, especially when I'm at the beach because it just makes your skin uh, glow and like shimmery or I don't know, shiny. It just gives you like this little golden tint. Um, I think Fenty has like a version of this, but this is from ColourPop and it's a lot cheaper. I don't know how much I paid for this, but I know I got it on sale. It's from Zara the set and then I have my um, Gucci rubber slides on so it's just like this whole 70s vibe the um, pants are like flared um, but I really love this outfit so and I definitely I didn't remember that I had these shoes when I was buying them and I just really think this is really cute and I'm wearing my Saint Laurent pouch uptime pouch and um ysl libre for fragrance this is my makeup look i use like a tinted moisturizer um that at this point is too light for me but hopefully it blended in we have reservations in like 15 minutes to like a mexican restaurant so i'm just waiting on sydney to get dressed and then we'll be on our way Sydney and I have like this whole 70s vibe going on not on purpose but I think we look really cute she got her um what color is that her little green uh tail far green. bag her outfit is from Zara as well it's just like this um blouse that ties in the front and a skirt and she's wearing white shoes I think she's pretty cute it's the morning it's we got up late today it's really like I don't know probably like one or something not sure almost one. almost one so we're about to go get something to eat and um, work out because we haven't done that today or like since at all during our trip and then we're going to head to the pool
isn't the golf course so pretty? I just wish that at nighttime, like, well, there's no light, so you can't really see the view at night, which kind of sucks. Um, but I really love that view. All right, I am waiting for Sydney to finish getting ready, and I'm also trying to upload a video. Well, it's uploaded now, but that's what I've been doing, and I'm just, I guess, waiting for it to process. Um, but yeah, I'm like really tired and low key. I just kind of want to take a nap or just like, I don't know, lay down and watch YouTube videos or something, but I'm going to force myself to get up and go to the pool. And I'm sure by the time I get there, um, I probably won't feel as tired. I don't even know why I feel tired because it's not like I'm missing sleep or anything like that. I don't know I think I just feel like being lazy I really love this view but it's like so hot and humid out here I was trying to sit out here and finish working on stuff but it's so hot so I'm wearing a black one piece I got this last year from Shein along with the black cover-up from Shein and I'm wearing my Givenchy pool slides. I am pretty sure I left my phone in the gym, so I'm about to hurry up and try to grab that. All right, I found my phone because my feelings were about to be so hurt. Um, but now we're about to head to the um, pool and probably stay there until like it gets dark outside. I think this is where we um, get our massages at. Ours are gonna be, we book massages. I don't know if I told you guys that or not, but um, I don't know if it's gonna be right here or there's like another area they have. I hope it's right here, but that, we'll do that on Tuesday. it's like after nine our reservations are until 9 45 and Sydney and I are both like super tired and the only reason why I'm going or we're still going because we're both super tired for whatever reason is because the food sucks like the buffet we don't really like the buffet like it's okay but to eat like every day it sucks and for whatever reason our reservation was like super late so this is what i'm wearing um the pants are levi jeans that i got on sale and just like a random shirt that i got from target um like a week or so ago and i'm just gonna find some sh shoes some random shoes to wear because i just really don't care i'm just hungry i'm just gonna wear these shoes um, I feel like I need a belt, but I didn't bring one. I feel like it would look a lot better with a belt on, but I don't have one. All right, this is the menu. Um, I guess you pick like a cold appetizer. I don't know if you get both or hot appetizer, but this is why we be hungry all the time. We did get like an extra reservation because we were supposed to only get four for like the seven days that we were here, like four nights of the a la carte restaurant. So I can't really complain too much about it because this is like the extra one. So 
we'll see how the food is. Okay, I got grilled cheese with some, um, it's not a grilled cheese sandwich, it's just like grilled cheese and like a tomato sauce thing. Let me show y'all what's in it. It's in it. I don't know why she picked that, but that's her appetizer. That's the reason why I came here. That's, that's what I wanted. Um, we have to hurry up and get breakfast because breakfast is like the only meal at the buffet that I enjoy. All right, I want some perfume, but I think I'm gonna wait until we get in the airport because their prices are pretty much like American prices um, and not really discounted. Now we're gonna go back to the room. I don't know what we're gonna do though. City wants to do like mini golf. Um, it's hot though, so I wanna go to the pool. I feel like this trip is like really uh, relaxed. Normally we would like go off the resort and do more things, but I just need a break um, and time to do nothing. And I don't feel like doing anything that's gonna have my blood pressure up. We were thinking about going zip lining and stuff like that, but I don't know. I just want to relax. I'm tired and law school and bar prep has drained me and I just need a reset. Alright, this is second one. I got two. To the beach. This is my bathing suit from Shein. And I got this cover up. It went with another bathing suit that I ordered um, last year, but the bathing suit didn't fit right. So I just have the cover up, but it just happened to match in my slides. It's so hot out here. We didn't even last the whole game of the mini golf because it was so hot and it wasn't a lot of shade for a lot of the time. We're gonna try to go horseback riding today. Um, if we have time or we'll just do it tomorrow. But I am so hot and I'm ready to like jump in the pool. We went ahead and um, booked a horseback riding for tomorrow and I wanna do these little paddle boats over here. Hold on. really enjoyed that sail roll. It was like so peaceful and calming and relaxing. I took videos in my phone and this thing, so I don't know how, like what it's gonna look like cause it probably is gonna look foggy. But I really enjoyed that. It was only $30 for the both of us together. So that was really nice. Well, $35, yeah. Whatever upcharge they gave us, but it, whatever. It was, it was worth it cause it actually was a lot longer than what I thought it was gonna be. But it was very relaxing, the water was clear. I think the deepest that the water got was seven feet all the way out there so you could see the bottom. And it was really nice and relaxing. I do think though, the dolphins that they got in that cage is giving very much Tiger King. I thought they were just like dolphins that were just in the water and not like pretty much trapped in a cage, but 
whatever we're on the beach now and we're gonna sit here for like an hour I'm gonna listen to an audiobook and just sit here for an hour and then I'm gonna get ready for dinner I'm rushing because we're running late but this is my outfit shirt from H&M these linen pants are from Express and then I have my Bottega Veneta Lebo sandals that I absolutely love these are like my favorite sandals um, and I don't wear them often enough I'm so nervous. They gave me a big course because the man said I'm a, a, a grande chica. That's what he said? <laughs> yes, because I'm tall. Let me take a picture. Okay. Alright, this might be all I can give you guys because I don't want to die. So we're back at the beach now. Horse riding was fun. I haven't been horse riding in like over 10 years. Um, I think, I don't even remember the last time, but I know it's been at least that long, but it was nice. It was also nice walking along the beach. And I don't know, it was the morning, so it was quiet. It's, I mean, there were some people playing music, but it was relatively quiet and peaceful, so I enjoyed that. Now we're gonna go to the little bed thing that we reserved. So this is our little setup for today. And this is the pool that is in this area, but I don't know if we're gonna stay. We probably won't stay in this area like the whole time, but yeah. So now we don't have to fight people for a um, lounge chair. We like stayed in our room for a little bit after we got back from horseback riding. So we missed, I guess, breakfast. Um, and they don't open the buffet until like 1.30 for lunch, but we get a massage at one and I think it's about um, like, I don't know. 1 uh 12 30 almost one so we just gonna get our massage but Jeffrey's view looks so pretty the water looks nice and blue and pretty it's just relaxing I wish I could like come here every day to lay on the beach Trying to figure out where we go for massages because nobody was at the place on the beach so um hopefully we won't be late Thank 
here. Where we are here. I want to enjoy my massage, so I don't think I'm going to record it, or if I do, it won't be a lot. This is the jacuzzi. They have an infinity pool here um, at the spa. So we're back in the little, I don't know. I don't know what to call this, the little bed bench thing. Um, and we're gonna chill here for a couple of hours until, and then when the sun starts to set, we're gonna go back to our room and get dressed and I will see you guys at dinner. I'm back, we're back in the room. It's, I, don't, I think it's like eight o'clock and um, we have reservations at nine. So I'm getting dressed for dinner. Today we're having the, going to the Italian restaurant. Um, I'm starving. I do have like enjoyed this trip. Um, I think all in all is one of the best resorts that I've been to, but the food is not, it's, not doing what it's supposed to do. The only, my only disappointment really is the food. So hopefully this restaurant is good. Um, I'm going to attempt to do a wash and go on my hair or like to wear it down, I should say. Um, since this is the last, I don't know if I mentioned this at all today but this is our last full day and our flight is tomorrow um so i'm gonna try to wear it down and actually take time to put the gel in my hair instead of just slapping it in there because i know i'm gonna wash it the next day um i'm using shea moisture curl enhancing smoothie and eco styler gel um it's the coconut um jar but i have the argan oil it's some coconut left over and i just put some argan oil in there so i wouldn't have to take my the argan oil of gel so i wouldn't have to um take the whole thing um i mentioned in one of my last videos that i got heat damage in may um so that also further complicates um how my hair cooperates in the summertime i usually don't wear my hair down in the summertime sometimes i do but i am less likely to and if i do it's only a wash and go um because i get a lot of shrinkage and when it's humid like it's super humid here um my hair shrinks a lot it just won't hurt like a style um so that kind of sucks you can see in the front there's like a section in the front that um is straighter it's i think it looks bigger than what it actually is because of the gel um i have been using the k18 um hair thing and that's helped too and i did like a apple g two-step protein protein um treatment and that's helped too but we're gonna see how, well, it'll be too late when we see, but we'll see how this works out. And, and it will help my hair dry faster. I wanna get box braids, like small knotless box braids, and I'll hopefully do that next week. We'll see, but that might seem backwards, like me getting them after vacation, but I don't like wearing braids on vacation when I know that I'm going to be in water because I don't want to wash the braids every day and then mess them up or just walk around with like 
heavy wet braids especially like if I get them like waist length like I want to this is the final product of putting the product in and we will see how it dries all right so this is what i am wearing to dinner i got this um dress from h&m and i'm wearing just some flat sandals they're tory birch sandals i had some black heels but it's i can hear thunder outside so I think it's gonna rain and it's just a walk and I don't feel like putting heels on. I'm wearing my YSL um, Uptown pouch, which is mixing metals, which I normally hate to do because it has silver hardware, but um, it's what I got and I don't feel like, um, I guess I could um, put silver jewelry on, but the hardware on my sandals is um, gold so it's unavoidable and i don't feel like taking all my chains off and stuff i also have on like this lip stain from fenty i don't know what these are called um but it's my first time using this and for a fragrance i'm wearing this chloe sample i don't know what the, i don't remember what the name is of this perfume but it, it's not my favorite, but it smells pretty good. And I didn't want to bring any of my like full size bottles. I just brought samples that I had with me. So we are on our way. Tonight we're eating Italian. All right, here is my food. It's like stuffed with salmon. And it has like a, a asparagus cream sauce. Let's see how it tastes. All right, guys, I am back in my room. Um, we leave tomorrow, so I am going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Thank you for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button, and I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Bye.